So listen, Beyonce, next time, ask for my address, okay? I just want you to focus. Pull me in, pull me closer. Give me that diagnosis. Don't my mind like explosions. Just one touch leaves me helpless. I'm repeat like it's endless. That she's done to a white dress. What's up, Core Crew? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Courtney Janine, and I'm back with another video. In today's video, you probably can tell from my outfit, but we are doing my Ivy Park X Adidas try on haul slash review. If this is your first time seeing me, don't forget to subscribe and join the Core Crew family down below. So first, before I try on the pieces and everything like that, I wanted to come on here and share my shopping experience and also the shipping process. This Icy Park drop drops last Friday, I believe, and today I'm filming it on Tuesday and that's when my package arrived. My shopping experience, this was the most stressful one. Um, I feel like honestly with all the Beyonce, Adidas, Ivy Park drops, it just gets harder and harder. Um, but this one was a little bit weird. I felt like a lot of us didn't know what time it was going to be, but I was granted access at 2 p.m. Eastern time. I believe an hour before I was able to start like building my shopping cart. So when it hit 2 p.m. All I had to do was pay now. The only confusing part was I felt like people were saying that it was already sold out at earlier times. Um, but when I got to it, I was able to get everything that I wanted. Let's get into the pieces that I picked up. Originally, I was only going to go for a brown outfit, definitely because I really wanted the bucket hat. The first piece that I picked up was this bucket hat. This is the reversible monogram bucket hat. I love this hat. I picked up like, I think every single bucket hat except the green one from the Drip 2 launch, but this one was just so cute. I love bucket hats, especially this one because it's super cute. It's also, I feel like, everyone will know that it's ivy park but you can definitely style this with other outfits that aren't like ivy park exclusive if that makes sense like i feel like a lot of these things like the pink outfits um you have to like style them together just because it's not easy to style them um separate so i felt like this was a piece that i could really use without pairing it with the other items from the ivy park honestly i think this is a bit pricier than the last drop just because this does have a fur on the other side and it is reversible so you can wear it on the first side but I always wear it with the denim just because I prefer that side but I really love this hat. I love bucket hats and I feel like they are definitely coming back in style. It's kind of like a tradition at this point. Every single Ivy Park drop, I pick up the bucket hat so I knew I wanted this piece. Because I was getting the Ivy Park bucket hat, I knew that I wanted a brown outfit but I wasn't sure which one to get. Honestly because in the past I've gotten more athleisure, more athletic wear like the um, cycling shorts and the sports bras and I knew I wanted something that I could just wear out, right? Um, so when I was looking at it, I just decided to go with the monogram crop top. Now I picked this up in a size medium. This you guys runs a bit small like I'm in it because I wanted to wear it with this hat for the video um, but it is not comfortable at all. I should have probably went with a large but it's a more tighter fit. The good thing though is because it's so tight it really gives you a lot of support in the boob area so if you were to wear this to the gym you could probably get away with it because they aren't going anywhere okay. To pair with this crop top I picked up the monogram sheer panel tight. These I picked up in a size large. Now you all know I don't know what it was but in the past I've literally been getting like a size small in the um, clothing items and this time when I got a large it was super comfortable so that's definitely probably my size. I know that on the adidas site it said that with the um leggings it was more of like a um tight fit so if you wanted something a bit looser to go up a size so i did that and i got in a size large i really like these they're super comfortable high-waisted high quality perfect for the gym but you know you don't have to it's definitely a statement piece if you want to just wear it as athleisure okay so that's my brown outfit um but i was torn because i really did like the pink items too and like i said the pink items are more like you have to wear them together so i picked up the monogram short tights in a size large definitely a good choice all my bottoms from now on i would definitely be picking up in a large because it just fits so much better and then the snap monogram top it's not as tight as this crop top but it is tighter i probably could have gotten away with a large with that too but i think it pairs with the um monogram short tights really well i got oh i also got the mask i got them in the size small um and they fit my face perfectly so 
that was a good thing. All in all, you guys, that's everything that I picked up. Hopefully this is the last one because my pockets cannot stand another Beyonce drop, period. So listen, Beyonce, next time, Ask for my address, okay? With that, let me know in the comments what did you pick up from the Ivy Park X Adidas haul, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys! I just want you to focus. Pull me in, pull me closer. Give me that diagnosis. Don't my mind like it's no chance. Just one touch leaves me helpless. On repeat like it's endless. That she's turned to a white dress. Looks so good, damn you.